In 1914, Benjamin formed a baseball team, the likes of which have never been seen before. These players all had long hair, long beards, and were considered to be some of the greatest players to have ever played the game. They had a few good players. A few, few guys were pretty good at baseball. Ben noticed there's a whole lot of them that are super talented athletic guys. So they had this family, the Tally brothers that came from Arkansas that were great baseball players. And he thought, you know what? He loved baseball himself. Why not form a team? So he formed a team of what he thought was the best baseball players in 1914. And, um, and part of the rule is that in, at the House of David in general is you don't ever cut your hair and men can never shave because he's supposed to be in the likeness of Jesus. And, and they quoted a scripture in Leviticus uh, because of that reason. So the men never cut their hair shaved. And, and, uh, and so by the time the boys got there, a lot of them came from other parts of the world already believing in this faith. So the boys had long hair, which is very unusual, right? So they start playing baseball in 1914. By 1915, they won the Michigan State Championship in baseball. By 1917, they're featured in the, in the Spalding Baseball Digest, which is like the Bible of baseball, right? By 1919, they're on the front page of the New York Times and the front page of almost every major media across the country. Here's this crazy oddity of a baseball team, guys with long hair and beards that are busting everybody's chops. They're beating everybody. By 1920, they were winning 70, 80% of their games and they're playing like 140 to 160 games a year. So by 1920, 21, they're the biggest draw in baseball. People in the community of uh, St. Joe and Benton Harbor, people that I had uh, given talks to and things like that, they would wanna tell me about going over to the house of David and watching a baseball game or a donkey ba baseball game or a game between Rube Foster's uh, uh, black team, Negro team. I think they were out of Chicago. Mm -hmm. 